For this next example, we're going to use the cube figure below. Let's start by naming all the segments that are parallel to AE. I'm going to go ahead and highlight AE in red. AE is a segment. For naming the segments that are parallel, remember that they need to be in the same plane. For same plane, just think about how it's going in the same direction. So AE would also be parallel to BF. You can see how that's in the same plane, going the same direction. We could do CG. Again, it's going in the same direction. I know there's not a plane that connects these two, but there could be right there, just as long as they're going in the same direction. And then finally, you also have segment DH. Now let's go ahead and name all the segments that are skew to AE. Remember, skew means that it does not intersect AE, but it also can't be in the same plane as AE. So all of the segments that I wrote for part A, those are not skew. You need to find the other segments that will never intersect it. So ignore the green highlight. Let's go ahead and look at DC. If it helps, you can find something that, like a shoe box at your house, that might help you visualize this better. A box of Kleenexes works pretty good. You can see how DC is never going to cross AE. So DC would be skew, as would HG. And let's see, there are a few more here. How about CB? And GF. And I believe that is all of them. If you try some of these other segments, they're going to inter either intersect AE or they're in the same plane as AE. So notice how EF doesn't work, neither does HE because they cross AE. Same with AD, AB crosses, and that's all of them. When you list all the segments that are parallel and all the segments that are skew, that should cover all of the segments that never cross AE. Here's a try now. I want you again to pause the video and give this problem a try. It's the exact same picture as our previous example, but now we're looking at the segments that are parallel and skew to GF. Go ahead and pause the video. So here I've listed all of them. Remember, you should have all of these listed down, but if you have the letters reversed, that's totally fine. Like if you called it instead of HE, you called it EH, that's the same thing. 